We're at Epsom Downs Racecourse for Fusion 19 and we're here with the man of the moment, Mr. Diego Barbosa, on the eve of his debut, professional yes. debut, I might add. Diego, please tell me, how did this come about? Because the last I saw you, all the lot, I'd have to admit, we're meeting under better circumstances this time. Last time you had a pull out, so he was a yeah. bit upset. How did the circumstances come around for you, know, for you turning that, you know, making a pro debut? Oh, it was just getting hard to find opponents and um, I was going to fight for the title, for the featherweight yes, title here. And um, my opponent pulled out and then John Spencer was going to fight with me for the belt. So I was like, well, instead of fighting semi-pro for the belt, why don't we just drop the belt and fight pro? Because obviously I was going to fight semi opponent anyway. So for me right now, beating him means I beat him if we was fighting set, uh, for the for the belt, so in my mind, I'm I'm the champion. It's a big step up, you know, from, yeah. from the from the semi pro ranks to the professional ranks. You know, what influenced your, your decision? Was your was it uh, management? Was it your coaches? You know, who was sort of like behind Man, the decision to become a pro? Hundred percent my decision. Yeah, I said let's do this, and and uh, they said yes, and we're here. <laughs> You just showed me a video um, of you warming up uh, before the fight where yeah. you was executing a flying knee. Yeah. Um, what made you decide to, you know, utilize this technique in, in this pro in this professional contest? I saw I saw videos of him, and every every video he kind of did the same thing. He would uh, put his hand up and that down. So I knew that if I, if I threw it, he wouldn't see it coming, and I would catch him. It was, you um, also appear to have a massive following. Right? Yeah. Uh, the, the, the building appeared to come off the roof when you came out. Um, what does this mean to your, to, your, to your fans and your friends, you know, being here tonight and making your pro debut? Man, it means the world. I mean, what's a guy without friends? He's a sad man. Um, if, you have, if you have friends, you have everything, man. And for them to be here for me right now, uh, I, 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 can't, I can't thank them enough. You made your uh, pro debut also live on pay per view as MMA okay. TV. Um, who was watching? My family in Brazil watching as always um, in many areas, many different areas in Brazil. And um, it's funny because everyone says, Oh, say this for me, say this for me. But when you just fight, you can't remember this stuff. So um, it's just amazing, man. Uh, on pay per view and headlining it, you know, it's the, and that fight, that finish is uh, wow. I, I still need to, to go to bed and then wake up tomorrow and realize what's happening. I would imagine after this performance, you're going to be, you know, a hot commodity on the UK MMA scene and you're going to have an influx of options. What is going to be next for Diego Barbosa? Man, it's. Like I said, I, I still need to sleep and, I, and wake up and see how everything feels. But whatever, whatever, man, I just want to get back in there. I mean, it feels good. You know when you go on a roller coaster, yeah. you, you kind of, shit, do I really want to go? And then you go and you're like, yeah, let's go again. But that's how I feel right now. If they say, you want to fight again, I'll fight again right now. But I need to, um, obviously, I can't think uh, that recklessly. So I need to talk to my team, look for mistakes that I did, obviously, and pick out good things and bad stuff and, and, and take it from there. Well, this is uh, Diego Barbesa making his pro debut at Fusion 19. Is there anybody you wish to fight? Man, my family in Brazil, my family here supporting me as always. Um, my team, Nova Forza, Binked, you guys, MMA TV, everyone. Thank you so much, Sid, for Mogul Management. Thank you, we are a strong team, man. We're coming. We'll see you soon. Peace. Peace.